Hi, welcome to Wellness. I'm your host, Linda Lonigan, Senior Clinical Nutritionist. I'm here to show you the very best your community has to offer in health, fitness, well-being, amazing events, and amazing people. Today, I have the lovely Daniela Hortonicio, who is an esthetician. Welcome. Welcome, Daniela. Hi, Linda. Thank Hi. you so much for having me here today. Thank you so much for being here. So tell me, please, how did this all begin? Okay, so um, again, my name is Daniela Hortensio, and uh, I am originally from Brazil, and I've been an esthetician for 13 years, mm -hmm. and uh, I decided to become an esthetician because uh, I used to have acne growing up, and uh, like uh, I used to go to the doctors, and none of the prescriptions would work, but uh, facials, it really cleared up my skin. And uh, I decided to become an esthetician because I really, really love not only for the results, but to see people like it's so beautiful to see people happy and feel good, you know, yeah. like after a nice That's relaxing right. facial for any issues, either if it's like an anti-aging facial, if it's an acne facial, or it's just to relax, right. you know? So right. I really enjoy what I do. Yeah, I find at Sarah's House of Health that your environment that you're in, that it's extremely welcoming. And you feel like you're an escape from reality. And right now, that's wonderful, that works. Yeah, that works so I am like very lucky to have that beautiful view that I have, yes. like with the lake view. Yes. But um, uh, I love like uh, being an esthetician mm -hmm. and um, I use uh, all organic. Mm -hmm. I have no chemical like in my office. Right. Everything is from fruits, plants, plants and vegetables. Which I which I was very impressed with. And you definitely walk the walk and talk the talk. Your skin is absolutely beautiful. Oh, thank you so much. And, and, thank um, you. I was a scientist prior to my graduate work as an MSRDN and I'm all about science and experiments and applying it to nutrition. You, you told me something that is so wonderful and visual that I'd love for you to share with my viewers. Yes, so, so before we do that, I would like to um, tell you, like, uh, let's say if you cut an apple and you leave it on your counter, right. it turns brown, it oxidizes, right? Sure. But if you put lime, which is vitamin C, prevents the oxidation, right? right? So that's what we're going to do here today. So um, I brought some water, okay, and uh, we are going to use this as if it was your skin, okay? And then we are going to use um, the iodine to represent sun damage, okay? So let's say you um, went in the sun and you didn't put uh, uh, your vitamin C, you didn't put your sunscreen, and uh, that's the sun damage, okay? That's but if you, prior to that, pre put your vitamin C, you can uh, shake, you put your vitamin C before you go in the sun, you see how it prevents the That's oxidation? Insane. That's fascinating, see? yes. How it cleared it up? You bet. Because you your bet. skin is protected. And now if you go in the sun again and you have sun exposure or you have like a any, like, uh, let's say if you have a glass of wine, uh, it's like all the, you know, yeah. like free radical. Of See? course, yes. Like how it cleared up. Superb, that's, that's, that's amazing. That so really is. So I highly so recommend uh, everyone right. to use vitamin C. Right, right. 365 days a year on your skin. Yes. Not only that, but sunscreen. No matter that's what wonderful. the weather outside mm -hmm. but you have to use vitamin c and sunscreen right. on your skin which is very very helpful because vitamin c is water soluble mm -hmm. which immediately exactly. we lose um in terms of for you to get the adequate amount of vitamin c in a day you would have to eat 30 oranges yes so, so yeah so yeah. they skin like the skin is the largest organ in your body right so whatever you feed your skin that's right. what's gonna you know show you like uh, in 10, 15 years, you know, like on your skin. Sure. Absolutely. And um, absolutely. another thing that I would like to share sure. is um, a lot of people, they uh, don't know how to take care of their skin mm -hmm. in terms of uh, product wise. They will go to the drugstore. They get overwhelmed with uh, everything they 
they see there. Sure and before are. they know, they are spending $100, $200 on something that they don't know what they're putting on their skin. Right. Right. So yeah. I highly recommend to look for an esthetician in your area right. to get the right recommendations. Right. We are the experts on how to put you in a routine, on a skincare routine, where you will know and make it, you know, more valuable for you. Absolutely. And uh, water is important, isn't it, Daniela? Absolutely. Yes, yes, yes. That's what's going to keep your skin hydrated. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and uh, a lot of people come and like, oh, I have dry skin. I don't drink enough water. Sometimes it's not by the amount of water you drink. It's by, by, uh, by what you feed in your skin. Uh huh. You know, so the moisturizer right. that you use, it needs to provide the moisture you need for your skin in order to have like a healthy skin and not healthy dry skin. or, yes. So you, you have tremendous expertise, Daniela, and you're so good at what you do. What are, <laughs> what you. are four, uh, three to four quick tips about your skin? What are the most vital things for your skin in well, addition to vitamin C? First of all, always, always wash your skin morning at, and night. Okay. Before you go to bed, it's right. very important. Okay. Because when you're sleeping, believe it or not, that's when your cell is regenerating. Right. So when you have a clean skin and you have your serums, you have your moisturizers, your moisturizer, that's when you are going to wake up right. with your a glowing skin. Sure. So that's tip number one. Okay. And then exfoliate. Mm -hmm. A lot of people go and say, oh, I use a scrub. No, it's not a scrub. It's an exfoliant, something gentle that you are keeping your pores nice and clean. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you okay. don't have a buildup of like, uh, you know, like pimples or blackheads or milia. Sure. Milia is the little white things that people are like, what oh, is this? Because you can't actually extract right because it's a closed pore interesting is that what it is yes so i always wondered what that was because i get it around my eye yes usually and caused by makeup really mm -hmm. wow yes the like the heavy product on makeup sure we clog your pore and right. your skin can breathe right so then that's what it is. And then don't try to extract yourself at home <laughs> because you will end up with a big blemish. It needs to be professionally extracted because we use, you know, the right tools and no, that's, everything. That's, that's definitely good to yes. know. Yes. And a mask, you know, like once sure. a week, it's very important. And don't forget the serum. Mm -hmm. The serum is the antibiotic for your skin. Okay. Either to prevent uh, aging, to get rid of uh, blemishes. Like in, in general, the serum is the most important of all. And you're talking about the vitamin C uh, Well, serum, there or? are so many serums, mm -hmm. but the vitamin C one is to prevent sun damage. Uh -huh. But then we have, you know, like serums to prevent aging, lines and wrinkles, you know, like that are, you know, tons of serums. Yes, but you have none. Which I would be happy <laughs> to invite everybody to come to Sarah's House of Health. Yeah. And uh, I will give them a complimentary skin analysis. Oh, that would be wonderful. And we can go from there, you know. I will provide samples and make sure you are on the right track taking care of your skin. That's very, uh, very generous, very thoughtful of you. Because Thank like you. I said, you know so much, Danielle. And every time I listen to you, I learn so much. <laughs> Just in general, you're, you're absolutely right. I've gone into stores. I get very overwhelmed in terms of all the products they offer. And for you to offer that, that someone come in and say, through my expertise, I'm able to look at your faces almost like a blank canvas and say, this is what your problem is. I mean, I just learned something today. What is the name again of those? Melia. Melia. Um, Melia, yeah. And it has to be As a matter of fact, uh, if somebody walks in the office trying, like, want to buy a product, I, like, rather not just to sell the product before I do, like, a full, like, consultation. Sure. Just to sure. make sure it's, like, the right choice. Right, to make sure. And, yes, and, yes. And, and the, and you know, the client will be happy with the sure. purchase and everything. Sure. Well, I want to tell you, I oh, want to thank, thank you so you. very thank much you. Thank for being you. here. Thank you so much. Oh, thank it you. It was a pleasure. Thank Wonderful. you. Remember when you eat well, select great foods and feel great.
it's something you want to do for the rest of your life. Remember, moderation and balance is key. And as Daniela says, hydrate, drink water, and take into account that wonderful vitamin C that we all know and need. And thank you so much to my wonderful crew. Have a nice night.